Okay guys, welcome back to series one, episode eight of What We Do in the Shadows. This one is Citizenship. If I remember correctly, it's Nandor wants to be an American citizen, maybe. <laughs> um, but yeah. Oh, I actually just remembered there is one scene that I actually really remember and it I think he has to say like the Pledge of Allegiance or something, but it has the word God in and vampires can't say the word God. But anyway, let's just get straight into it. Even a strange girl, the most beautiful gift <laughs> becoming a vampiric blood sucking creature. Oh my gosh, her reflection is, uh, she has not oh, it's fading and like moving differently. I think she is on her way. I've just been going through changes. <laughs> Having crazy dreams, like super weird. Her roommate is just so chill. I'm usually a flexitarian. Flexitarian? What is a flexitarian? Sensitivity and skin sensitivity. And sometimes, sometimes I have this urge to tear my roommate to shreds. Oh my god. <laughs> if you are gonna entice a victim into the house and then you let them leave, show them out. Loud and clear. Fair enough. It's right. <laughs> it is. Also, is it possible to blow out the candles? Oh my gosh, you need to blow out the candles. <laughs> that was a good blow. That may be me. I'm a snake in heat. Called Mr. Hijinx. Okay, guys, <laughs> what does that even smell like, Lazlo? <laughs> to annoy you. Touche. <laughs> I was the leader of Al Kalnador. That sounds like you've just made it up. Sounds fake. No, I <laughs> it does sound fake. It's a real country. Not so hot. It's dissolved. When did this happen? 1401. 1401? And he didn't know. How can he not know? Would he not check up on his old country? Yes, I was driven out for pillaging and killing and torturing. And that's fair enough, really. But now what do I have? <laughs> it's fair enough. No Being a bit of a... <laughs> an annoyance. A pest, if you will. Disabled, very sickly donkey that you want to smash Everything to Nadia comes back to donkey. Do we know who turned Nadia? This is a bag of soil from my homeland that I take with me when I travel. Well, I mean, technically, it's. <laughs> I mean, the land is. <laughs> oh my god, Nando. The land is still there. It's just called something else now. <laughs> You don't want to hear about all this. You were running away. Are you okay? <laughs> kind of you to it, but really you go. Or if you were an American citizen. Is that possible? Of course. Does yes. anyone feel better for being an American I citizen? I will make an alliance with this unholy Sorry. nation and make this place my home. There you go. I think that's the bus stop there. I'll see you back at home. Oh. They always just leave poor Guillermo. Yeah. You are living like a little chimney boy. If you <laughs> You're living like a little chimney boy. You just have to complete your transition. Okay, is there any way I could just drink their blood but not kill them? Shh. You just shut up now, my stupid. <laughs> okay. I mean, so yes, though. They house. literally had the house meeting. They're like, if you don't kill your victim, yeah. show them out. Excellent. I applied for my American citizenship back in 1992 for five reasons and five reasons only. The starting lineup for the 1992 US Olympic men's basketball team. Basketball. Green team, baby. I call this okay. <laughs> Nando Team being a basketball fan is um, less field. <laughs> I simply had to pledge my undying allegiance to their nation. What happened in 1992? Why didn't you complete the process? Did they Probably lose? Because the Macarena. <laughs> so he was too busy doing the Macarena. Time for, anything else. for the whole year. Vampire has their own special. Your lip seductively. Ow. 
Okay, maybe seduction <laughs> isn't your special power. Yeah, seduction is not her power. I am an excellent crawler. You can see. I love when Nadia just crawls. It's so funny, but how is that like her special power? What the hell is going on? She should be in a bloody cage. So Laszlo isn't a fan of uh, his wife's new child. Where were you born? El Colnadar. 1262. Oh. Where is that? Southern Iran. Mm -hmm. Maybe not mention Iran. <laughs> Why don't you leave your country? <laughs> Standard reasons, uh, driven out by peasants. <laughs> How many times have you been married? Just the once. Okay. To 37 women. <laughs> I say, little vampire, I'm very sorry for saying that you should be kept in a cave. Vampire, there is. Oh, parenting. No. Really? Absolutely. George Washington. Yes. America's first gay president. <laughs> Washington was actually... Yes? I don't know. <laughs> it sounds like Nando has some experience with that. <laughs> Is she a vampire now? Oh, Guillermo. Everyone gets turned into a vampire but you. What are you doing? If I'm gonna be a bat then don't i have to get where do my clothes go it's a good question she's asking good questions um, let's not get bogged down in the details <laughs> Hold on for now. Oh, okay. i love that they've never considered it though i just shout bat human form much like that oh it's okay calm down giant human bat what would you even call that we the people. <laughs> we the people. We the. Someone threw a bag of garbage off the roof. Well, don't investigate. Hi. Yeah. Uh. Bag of garbage. <laughs> the shade. Figure it out on your own since you're a fucking vampire now. Yeah. <laughs> I can hear you. <laughs> I do think she's very much ready for her first human meal. I believe in you very much. We're going to go Maybe to the first human meal days. will help her With become more vampiric, you know? Whatever the hell we want to do. And you will respect women a lot more after this, okay? Nadia, doing God's work right there. <laughs> Make me one with your evil empire. Maybe I don't call it an evil empire. Also, Nando's not very good at hypnotizing, is he? Well, that Please could be it. Their arms. If it's a nice day, <laughs> you should have the right to pay your arms. All right. I would have thought Nando would know that one though, seeing as he was such a like a a fighter. He was a warrior. Oh, Jenna. <laughs> Oh, Nadia's trying so hard. It's really cute. First three words of the Constitution. What are these words? Freedom. <laughs> hey, you guys. What does the Constitution do for the people? It oppresses them. It frees them. I don't know. Are you a I just think maybe you're not trying hard enough. Just watch me, okay? Oh, hello. Oops, I'm very sorry for bumping into you. I will punish myself later because I'm such a bad girl. Nadia is insane when she flirts. Very bad for making such a big I love you. Now go upstairs, put your head deep inside the toilet bowl, and flush it seven times. <laughs> I, think, I think that was an abuse of power. Nadia is amazing. Nobody sees me! Why don't they see me? This is pointless! Nobody hear me! 
Well, special power revealed. <laughs> or not revealed. <laughs> <laughs> Nadia is so proud. So many human with this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she can control it too. Get him, Jenna. Get him. <laughs> Don't say hi, Jesus. Oh, there you go. Vampire transition complete. No, oh, she's such a proud mum. Did, did she actually fill up her reusable water bottle? Not now, big boy. Go and eat some bricks. Mental reservation or purpose of evasion. So help me. <laughs> Honestly, I think it's kind of strange that to become an American citizen you have to swear to God. Like, what What if that's against your religion? What if you're not religious? <laughs> Did they not find it strange that fire came out of your mouth? Stop fucking complaining. Yeah, no. You're a vampire. Proud of who you are. Camo. Camo. my words. I am a proud vampire. Who are you shouting to? Bow down to your paternity as you rot and your bones turn to dust. <laughs> So are you going with the Baron's plan of domination, or...? <laughs> I appreciate you telling me how it is back there. Your tone was highly disrespectful, but... You're right. Thank you. You're welcome. Aww. Back, you probably meet some vampire psychic too. Nah, I'm good. Oh. Wow. Well. Can we, like, watch the sunrise or something? That would be so nice. Oh, oh honey bun. bun. About that. Um, funny, very funny story. You can never go in the sun again. Sorry. I am a little Sorry. I didn't get to be a can she go in the sun when she's invisible? Because really technically she's invisible. Oh, you don't need to or is it, but she can still affect the world. Really? Yeah. Even in Al Nadar, you couldn't get the sword without the checking of your background. I got it! No! <laughs> Wait! You had to have your background checked in the, the 1200s to get a sword. Crazy. Uh, well, Jenna needs to get the hang of it and they need to learn that uh, UV is not in everything that's just dark. Um, <laughs> but yeah, poor Guillermo. Never gonna get turned into a vampire, is he? <laughs> and Nandor, at least he realised that he didn't need a citizenship to belong where he is. You know, maybe he'll go for that human domination thing again. But anyway, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!